Hey, fellow football lovers, it is I, Super Paul Games. Let's go look at the top 25 poll. This week we're going to be playing LSU, the Tigers. You can see the Tigers are number two. If you remember from last season, we faced the Tigers in the BCS Championship and beat them last year, so it's a rematch of that. They're 7-0. and Where are we? We're undefeated too, but we're getting no respect. We're on the coaches' poll right now. We're only 11 on the coaches' poll. There are teams with losses ahead of us. Including, didn't we beat Alabama? I hate the coaches. Let's look at the media poll. The only true poll. They say we're number four in the nation. Where we belong. So let's do it. The long-awaited rematch of last year's BCS championship. The number two team in the nation. And the number 11. Thanks to damn coaches poll. Hi, everybody. Brad Nessler in the booth, along with Kirk Herbstreet. Aaron Andrews is reporting from the sidelines. Today's game is brought to you by EA Sports and ESPN. We've got the Navy Midshipmen and the LSU Tigers. Baton Rouge and Tiger Stadium, the site for this college football battle. Uh, sometimes I miss living there. Not, not, not in the stadium, but I mean in Baton Rouge. <laughs> Sorry, Tigers. We're here to defeat your dreams, hopefully. They are way better than us on paper. On paper? On player? On paper! She looks like she's wearing a Minnesota Vikings jersey. If you look at the skill sets of their players, they are better than us. But hopefully we can pull it off like we did in the National Championship. Hurrah! This intense season continues, and we've got what should be a great game coming your way. For Navy, it won't be easy to rein in the quarterback. This defense doesn't necessarily have... Oh, my God. So if he this guy has already passed for 2,300 yards this season? Now let's take this is game eight of the season. What is that? That's like two-thirds of the way through the season? Oh, my God. He's going to pass for like 4,000 yards. We're going to get... do great. All right. We won the coin toss. We're going to kick off. Both teams have sent their special teams out of the field, and we're ready for the opening kickoff. Um, why is help coming up? Oh, I'm hitting the wrong button. <laughs> Sorry, I've been playing golf on Twitch, and uh, I was like a little while ago. So I'm trying to use the golf buttons. So like, Coach, why don't you bring your golf clubs? What? I'm having fun. All right, come on, defense. From their own Death Haven, Dorch, G, Morton, Flab, on the line. I thought he was just gonna hold on to it all day. Where you going, son? Nope. He's not gonna get back to the line. He just timed the snap count there and really made a nice play. From their own 26 yards. For our linebackers, you can second see Frazier, Deontay Wash, and Ancient Stranger. And then I probably won't get to the secondary. Come on, come on, come on. Get that pressure. Nice job. Good job by Marshall knocking that down. Incredible speed by that corner. But also, the quarterback kind of helped him there by putting a little bit too much air under it. All right, we're going to try and overload the weak side. Weak like a baby. Oh, shit. No. Nope. Nope. Somebody get there. They knock it down. Incomplete. Sorry, Tigers. I'm sure they want revenge for the BCS championship last year. Now their punt returner will get a chance to make something happen. That is the way to start the game, though, with a three and out. I love it. Come on, Blop. Blop. Block for panic! Shit lords. And down he goes. Just like last year. The coverage team did their job and made the play. Let's see if the defense can continue the effort. They'll start this drive at the 32. It's first and ten. Uh oh, you can see Mr. America is nervous about the big game. And often he's met immediately. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. Hopefully by doing a few run plays like that we can settle him down. 
Oh, look, he's still nervous on the road. He's like, they want to make me eat king cake. There's a baby in there. I don't want to eat a baby. Or do you? And that was an excellent run there. Yeah, Brad, but it was also great blocking up front by the offensive line to open up the hole. This two tight end formation is working pretty well so far. Let's try and play action, see if we can... Oh, man. All right, the question marks mean he doesn't know what they are on the route sheet. Crap. Mr. America, why are you not settled down? Oh, Sheepy's almost caught that terrible throw. We're going to go back to the run game, I guess. It's Mr. America's shit in his britches. Yeah, there we go! Nice option play. Good lateral by Mr. America. Hopefully that'll settle him down. See, it's like a pass. It's a backwards pass. Right now, I want anything and everything out of this formation. As we're having a lot of success with it. Ooh, they came up for a kiss on the left side. Trying to kiss 88, our tight end. The Butler did it. That was the name of the guy who did it. Ha ha ha. <laughs> uh, I don't remember what I was calling. Were we going to throw it outside? Let's do a sprint through. What was that, the B gap? I don't know what gap it's through. Because the team's freaking out. Nice job by Hayden. That's the backup to Hartman. I love seeing that. Right, let's go through the A gap on the right side. So far, well, I don't want to say I'm going to jinx us, but so far this is going better than the BCS Championship game win last year. Okay, we got two. It's second down, eight to go. Hopefully we're tired out their defensive line. Our offensive line's getting a little tired. Come on, Mr. America, settle down. Yeah, get those blocks. Woot woot. I love how well our offensive line is playing. It's making it look like we're their better skilled team, even though we're not. Don't be jabber, John. I don't want no dumb penalties. to see something straight up the middle. All right, Hayden, just take it right up the gut. Not right up the butt, though. And, off and it's good! Asigo, are you here? You show up? He's like, where's my daddy Asigo? <laughs> Please never call him that again. Woo! Suck on that, Baton Rouge. There's Asigo. <laughs> Maybe just showed up. He's like, I was getting a beer. That or maybe he was coming in from the casino boat. Oh, well, please don't screw this up, Adams. And it's good! It's the PAT. But here's the drive summary to recap what just happened. Woohoo! See, coaches, why we rank number 11 in the nation? They line up to kick this one away. If they don't rank us number one in the nation after this, I'm gonna scream. <laughs> We've beaten, I think, Alabama. Didn't we beat Georgia? We beat Notre Dame. We've beaten a bunch of top 25 ranked teams. The last time this offense had the ball, it was three and out. They'll get the ball here at the 20-yard line. First and 10. Because he clicked Tazard and Quentin Daniels, our safeties. I'm trying to show off more of the defense this game. 
Sometimes it's hard to do that before they hike the ball, though. To the right and tackled immediately. Good job by the D. Two yards on the carry. That brings up second and nine. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 22-yard line. You see, too, that we're playing a very vanilla defense, but it works. Oh, shit. Nice job getting pressure. Did you see how quickly he was able to get into the backfield and make that? Doherty. Not many guys that big can move that fast. From their own 18-yard line, third down. The defense timeout. calls a timeout. You can see we were set up in the wrong formation. That was a mistake. I hit the button too fast. Come on, Doherty! Oh, shit! <laughs> I wish it would have been backwards and been a fumble. It was interesting, at least. Making him go in three out, three and out again! And it wasn't that long ago that these guys were ranked number one in the nation. I think MSU or U of M has just had a tougher schedule being in the Big Ten and all. And that's why they're number one right now. Way not to block, dude, on the left. Now here's the situation you look for when you're on the road. Try to get a good lead early and quiet down this crowd. Man, I'm loving this two tight end formation. Navy. Mr. America still is not settling down. That's all right. Let's do a counter to the right. From the defensive side of the football, they know what this team likes to run, and they got the better of them that time. Navy is up the score. Right. I don't remember. All right, we're doing a counter to the left. So I don't remember the audibles. No, oh, you shit lord! He blew right through that hole. It's never good for a back Please get up, Hartman. <laughs> Just keep at it, and the holes will start to open up. This is what I wanted to avoid, because you can see Mr. America is still super nervous and scared. There we go, Tenlo Soul saving the day. Nice catch. That's why he's the number one receiver on this team. And I don't mean yard-wise, that's club panic, but a lot of that is a result of my offense, so I love hitting the slot receiver, because so often, the slot receiver's position is where you get the best mismatches. Great job by Mr. America, even though he was nervous, and Tenlesol, to keep this drive alive. That is the world's worst tiger in the middle of the field. <laughs> it looks like an abstract painting. I'm not saying that their logo is bad. I'm just saying the way they painted it on the field didn't come out so good. From the 42-yard line, second down. Let's see if we can set them up with a play action right here. That did not work. Nobody was even open. Big ol' loss. He just got a new boyfriend on that play. Come here, Mr. America. You my girlfriend. No. The booty hole. The linebacker time to make the play. Third and long here, and they hope to convert another one and keep this drive going. The crowd is really letting them hear it. All right, we're gonna have the tight ends block. That's what I was fucking around with. Looks to pass. No, 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 no! Yes, Tenlosol, way to come back and get that. We're still short though, fourth and six. So they're gonna go for it here. Shit, I wasn't gonna go for it. But we're gonna run it right up the middle. No! 
second! We had that huge gap right up the middle, and the right side just fell apart. I guess I should have punted it, but I was like, we got that opportunity there, let's take it. Man, I can't believe how fast the right side collapsed. I knew it wouldn't hold up forever, but they just fell down. Three yards on the carry. That'll make it second to seven. This game's already shaping up to be a good one as we head to the second quarter. Our score here in Baton Rouge, Navy, seven, LSU, nothing. Well, it's nice to be batting back in Baton Rouge. So let's go get some crawfish. Mm. Second let's try and win the second quarter. I like the 7-0 lead. Uh-oh. Both of our defensive tackles fell down. Well, their quarterback just sent a new record for LSU for passing. That's not so excellent for us. We've done a pretty good job so far, though, keeping his passing up. We're going to blitz. Let's bring it. didn't go far. They'll spot the ball a yard from the line of scrimmage. It's second and nine. Come on, team. Get us that ball back. Is that Terry Gilliam over on the right side? I guess it would make sense because he seems so animated. Oh. Shit, fuck. <laughs> Alright, third and five, dudes. It's time to get hard. You're like, coach, you're not allowed to talk like that. Third and five. Oh no! Your screen makes me scream. Oh, not happy about that. Yeah, it sounds like every pass Quinn makes is gonna be a record. Are we gonna hear that for the rest of the game? Thinking you all fancy there, Mr. Tiger. It's first and ten. Ball on the 23-yard line. Let's press those receivers. Well, that worked out. Oh uh, shit. They like to run through all their routes before the game. And I have to say, they look sharp before this one even started. Yeah, you tell him, Quinn. We're gonna bring it. Here they go. First and goal. Down by a touchdown. This will be the first snap inside the 20 today. Come on, get some pressure, guys. Yes! Quentin Daniels! And it's wide fucking open! Hell yes! Pick six. Hey, is this part of your record, LSU quarterback Quinn? You threw another touchdown. Holy shit. That's about as long of a pick six as you're ever going to get. He's like, suck it, bitches! That was outstanding. And he hits the PAT. It annoys me that Adams is probably going to be in charge of a ship death someday. Because <laughs> he's been such a failure here. Maybe he'll be a good officer, though. How was that not the quarterback's fault? He threw it. He just threw a jump ball in the end zone under pressure, and he underthrew it. That's totally his fault. He just almost threw another pick. It looked like the quarterback thought he had an open receiver there, but I don't think he saw the linebacker. I'm starting to feel like our defense this year might be better than the one we had last year. Oh, you juked me! 
Damn it, you have bamboozled me, you bastard! I'm like, I- oh, no. Can't trust little people, they're tricky. From their own 27 yard line. It's hey, down. Skates Brick is back out because he's a brick house. Nice! Their option play didn't get off in time. Drove him back. This defense is coming into its own at the right time. It's fourth down. The punter comes on the field, getting ready to send one off. Honestly, skill wise, player wise, this might be the best team we play all year. That, or, you know, if we get the BCS championship and play Michigan or whatever that might be. But I'm really impressed right now with how our team's doing. The offense will start at the 36 yard line. Even though uh, uh, Mr. America is still nervous. Get those blocks, get those blocks. Could have been so much more if I didn't bounce off a guy. Whatever, still four yard gain. The offensive line has got to do a better job of making space because that was just a punishing hit. So what would you say we are, an old-fashioned run-and-gun offense? Straight run, nothing going on there. Two-yard pickup. Third and five. Your offense looks like pee-pee, ha <laughs> ha. Should be an ass. In fact, I probably have some LSU stuff lying around the house if I were to like look around. I'm not saying that the yellow is PP color. I don't feel bad because I have friends who are LSU fans. Sheepies, go deep. We got a free play. One of their guys jumped. Yep, Mr. America might be nervous, but he's still making those good throws. Situations. You can see nobody's on sheepies, too. And Mr. America was a perfect throw right before he gets popped. You know what's... <laughs> you know the game's going good? I guess where you can hear the cheerleaders. Because the home crowd is so quiet, they're taken out of the game. I know it might sound like a jerk, but do cheerleaders really matter? Has there ever been a time where you've been at a game and like, I don't know what to do? Hey, those people, they've made me decide I need to cheer. Get that block, Alan. That was perfect. This is the option to go back three yards. Might have gone to the well too many times on that play. Third down, and they need to get it to the 28. I'm trying to watch those safeties to see what they do. All right, we're going to have one-on-one -on -one coverage with Tenlo Soul. Sheepy's block. Uh, Allen block. We need extra time. There we go. Tenlo Soul coming again. That was just reading the defense, seeing the one-on-one -on -one matchup. And then trusting he was going to come down with it. Takes a bit of a shot there. Don't be jabberjawing with him, dude. We don't need no penalties. Come on, get back here. We got more plays to run. First and ten. Oh, nice run by Hayden. That'll be a gain of five. He looks so tiny compared to everybody else. It's like somebody brought their little brother to play. It's second down and four to go. Ball on the 21. We got all our timeouts. I'm not too worried about time right now. There we go. Hartman. Go, 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 go. Yeah, touchdown. Hopefully we didn't score too fast. And this should really help prove to themselves that they can control the clock with the ground game. Yeah, I didn't think Hartman was going to have a giant game like that. Very silent 
Tiger fans. Uh, let's kick that extra point. After the game, Muffaladas for all. Boom. It's good. Now I want a Muffalata. Damn it. I made myself hungry. And I think right now our team is hungry for victory. Boom. All right, defense. We just got to shut him down for a minute 22 left. Our defense has been outstanding this game. Oh, no, I thought I had him for a second. At first, I was confused. I didn't realize they were, like, in a pistol offense. I was like, why is there a fullback a baby? I was like, oh, wait, that's the quarterback. Oh, yes, the sack. I'll take credit. Basically, Morton just rolled and rolled and rolled until we pushed him over into number 61, Flab. Flab's like, yes, please. Third and ten coming up. One minute left in the first half. Hey, there's Mr. Hooper. Are they running the clock out? I have no problem with them doing that. Kind of surprised they'd be doing that if they came out with shotgun. Looking to throw. Oh, he was way jacked up. I think we're just gonna run the clock out here because I don't want to do anything stupid with how important this game is, and we got a three-score lead, and we start with the ball in the second half. The snap. Booming kick. So somebody just blocked for Club Panic. And he makes it out to about the 41-yard line. The quarterback is on his way back onto the field, and he led a great drive last time out. And hopefully the offense will be calmed down. Oh, look, they're calm finally. Now that they've seen that they can compete with these guys. And he carries the ball for a nice game. They gained five yards there. I'll admit, I did not think the first half would go this well. I don't know what you all second thought. Down, six yards to go. As long as we don't shit the bed in the second half, things are looking good. First half comes to a close as they head to the locker rooms. Our score here in Baton Rouge, Navy 21, LSU nothing. Yep, that's why we have the championship from last year. Not because of the score in this game, but because we outplayed them. Hopefully we can for the second half. Just keep this on. What I want now is a nice long drive for a score. Doesn't really matter even if it's a touchdown or a field goal. As long as we're smart with the ball, long drive, time-consuming drive. Establish our dominance. Make them all bitches. Yeah, I know what stadium I'm in. Oh, if that guy had not caught up with Hartman, he would have been gone. They got really lucky there. Tell you what, though, I will definitely take that nine-yard gain. I like how the fans are all like, LSU, LSU, and now they're quiet again. Come on, Hartman, yeah! He's just like, bitch, get off me! Mm. That's good enough to pick up the first down. If you can consistently get four or five yards at a pop, you know that you're going to have a functioning offense. Yep, our offense does not shoot blanks. I want that counter play. We've been killing them with that today. From their own 32-yard line, first down. You can see the star over on the top left side there. Their safety, they have a really good safety. Are all over the place and they'll blow it dead. Who did that? Man, excellent. That's what, the third time their defense has gone early this game? Let's see if we can try a play action. 
I don't know if they're going to bring everybody up or not. There we go. Totally worked. Nice. I wish I could have him ladder roll it to Tenlo Soul. I don't think they have a hook and ladder play in here. That's something you never see in real life. From their own 49 yard line. First down. I think whoever drew that tiger in the middle of the field doesn't know what a tiger looks like. They'll go with the option. There we go. Nice run. Oh, we got Hayden coming out too. Second and three coming up here. We might have to run more two tight end stuff. Usually I run a lot of eye form, but maybe two tight end sets is better set for our team. Inside run and he's hit hard. Hayden got hit hard too. Like you said, clothesline little man. That's all right. The defender came in and dropped the hammer. All right, let's get Mr. Rogers into this, our fullback. That's just all we needed right there. Push ahead enough to get them inches. 50 or 58 there? I don't know if their guys are getting injured or tired because they're having... It's taking longer for them to get back up. I think we're just wearing them out. From the 40 yard line. First down. And can you believe the coaches rank these guys number two in the nation? You'll get the call again. Yeah, nice jukes by Hartman. He's up to 100 rushing yards now. We've seen this guy dominate over the course of today's game, and this drive has pretty much told the story. I mean, this offense is just steamrolling right down the field. I would guess he probably watched. He got to watch Jamez all those years. Maybe learn some of the moves from Jamez. Drops back to pass. Uh, get out of there, Mr. America! He's at the twenty. So the keeper goes for about seven. Yeah, there, it wasn't meant to be a QB keeper. I was looking for the tight end, but the coverage. He might have been able to get it. I didn't think it was worth the risk. So we just said to stay conservative on the ground, and it worked. It's second and two. Ball on the 20-yard line. So their last red zone... Yeah, that's a good idea. Bring all the touchdown. safeties on the outside. Let's see if the defense can hold them this time. Maybe they're worried about the counter we've been doing? There we go, Hartman. Another big first down. Making it look easy. They need to start hitting the gaps and getting into the backfield. Here's play number 10 on the drive. I like this wearing out the other team. Look at that. Wide open. Oh, shit. Should have caught in a little bit earlier. That's all right. Still good game. Well, let's use our power. Second down. They can smell the end zone as they line up three yards out. And what exactly does an They're end zone smell like? Scrimmage. Come on, Hayden, push! They work the right side, and there is nothing going there. All right, let's give it to Mr. Rogers here. He's trying to shove it up the middle. All right, we might, might audible. <laughs> They got a million guys right there. Oh, fuck it, we're gonna go right at him. Push, Rogers, push! Hell yes! Our team is just getting better and better as the year has gone on. I cannot believe we are crushing these guys. I know it's not over yet, but this is not the game. When I looked at the schedule at the beginning of the year, or even before the game, 
that I would thought that we'd have, uh, what is this, a four touchdown lead in the third? If we can win this thing, we, we should be number one in the nation. I don't know if the coaches poll will give us the credit we deserve, though. They've been such dickweeds so far. No, you ain't going nowhere, Kelly. Actually, we weren't playing run all the way. Ball on the 22-yard line. We only had four uh, linemen on it. It's not like we had eight guys in the box. Oh, yes! Dick Johnson! Suck it, Quinn! Quinn, the record-breaking LSU quarterback. He's thrown us two touchdowns already. Saucy shimmies. We're running away with it right now. Oh! <laughs> that was scary, but it worked. It wasn't the end of the world if we didn't get that. At least I hope not. But and it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. It's fielded at the two. Makes it to the 22-yard line. It's going to be interesting now to see if this quarterback can put that last throw behind him. Now you feel bad for this offense because they're clearly struggling. No, I, I don't feel so bad for their ahead. offense, even if they are struggling. Our defense is just playing an outstanding game. He's taken down around the 36-yard line. Great touch by the quarterback. Blowing that one right into his hands. That takes some skill. Oh, the cheerleaders finally have something to celebrate. From their own 36-yard line, it's first down. This stadium is so quiet. Oh, man. At least somebody bounced it back to Morton. Hit him hard right there. Stayed on his feet for a while there. I'm surprised they are running. Ball on their own They're down by, what, five touchdowns. Quinn drops to throw. Hit Quinn. Oh, Quinn just juked the hell out of our guy there. He's just like, oh, hell no. Whoop. <laughs> Thank God for Moses. From their own 47 yard line. First down. Doherty's getting tired, but the rest of the team still pretty fresh. He looks to throw on first down. Oh. oh and he's right there to knock it away. This just shows you that you don't need Deontay Washington his hands on that. Oh, she would have caught it. From their own 47 yard line. Second down. They're going to have to speed things up a little bit if they're going to get into this game. You ain't going nowhere, Kelly! You're not going to get past Jackson's lab. Action Jackson took you out. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 43. So far, my player of the game is the defense. <laughs> you might be like, that's cheating! You can't pick a whole side of the ball. The defense has been outstanding. And that one's incomplete. Nice play by the defense to bring up fourth down. Yeah, instead of going for the interception, they did the same thing, and that was just to tip it away. Merch to punt. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. Block, block, block. Not a bad return. Around the 17-yard line. Made a few guys miss on his way to a quality return. First and ten. 
We're going to try and take a shot downfield a little bit. Alright, sheepies, I need you to do uh, block. They need to hurry. The offense oh, it the took too long. Time. Trying to audible, but the button... Yeah, I didn't get the button stuff fast enough. I was like, why isn't it doing it? I guess I didn't hit it fast enough. Alright, delay a game. Not the way I wanted to start that. Could be worse. So the penalty makes it first and 15. What I was trying to do was get more protection for Mr. America so we could try and hit Tenlo Soul deep again. Well, what the hell? I don't think I hit a button there. Maybe I did and I didn't realize it? I hope my controller's not going out. Navy is winning big. Try to change the play. You can hear me hitting the button. I don't know if something's wrong with my controller, I fear. Looking to throw. Home run ball in the air. Tipped away. Well, that would have been hard to do or get through. His covered receivers some room to improvise and get free. Let's get this clock started again. Push, push, push. I know that's a little conservative, but I think we can afford to be conservative right here, considering the situation. Looks like they've decided to go for it here. I gotta tell you, I'm really surprised that they aren't gonna just pump this ball away. Did somebody uh, false start on that? We drew a guy. We're gonna accept that. We're gonna go back out there and try it again. The only reason I'm doing that is because I wasn't gonna actually run a play. They're gonna try to go for it because we're gonna run out of time. But see if we can draw a guy again. Their legs are all over the place, and they'll blow it dead. Was that on us this time? God damn it, you idiot! Well, we're definitely not going to try a 101-yard field goal punt. That pisses me off. The offensive line should have known what we were doing. They didn't need to be stupid like that. Oh, God, that was bad. I wanted to angle it some. His leg is so weak. Get them! Brought down at the 46. Not much of a contest here as we head into the final stanza. Our score here in Baton Rouge. The Tony Danza? What? 35. The Tigers, nothing. They'll start at the 46-yard line. First and ten. First down. Look at the throw. Fires to the wideout. First down. And down he goes. Around the 28-yard line. Uh, get over there, Morton. Good tackle there in space. I'll tell you something. I'm loving this quarterback's confidence more and more as this game goes on. He's really throwing the ball with some purpose. First down, 10 yards to go. Well, they did have a very short field. I'm not too worried about them scoring here. The important thing for us is just to win. It would be nice, though, if we could make them burn some time. Somebody get him, please? I mean, I didn't expect him to run. Nice blocking on the counter, and he was able to pick up around eight yards. All right, we're gonna go to the play that we got. Uh, it's second down. The first interception we turn on. Come on, get that pressure. I can't believe he caught that thing. Mills gets him about three yards with a completion. I'll tell you, these guys just keep rolling down the field. Quarterback. Does he not want to touch that? <laughs> that ball is dirty. <laughs> Clean your dirty balls. I think he's still horrified by that. Seven yards for the touchdown. 
And they might be coming with a blitz here. Quinn, back to pass. He's Somebody catch that! Somebody catch that! Oh! I can't believe one of our guys didn't get his hands on that. to stop to run, but here he showed that he's not too bad against the pass either. They're gonna blitz. Wait, I think this is the one we got the the uh, interception on. I think we did a blitz. We went all out. And off up the middle, and he stopped. Drop back a yard. One of the other things that is excellent. That was a great stop. Is we are making them burn the clock. All right, we're going to put everybody out. Everybody's covering the pass right here. He drops back. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough. Yeah, that's all right. They're going to have to go for it, though. Disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. We might do the exact same thing. Everybody falling back to play pass. We're just going to have our front four try and get some pressure. Get him short! Get him short! Yeah! Excellent job by the defense. Someone's got to step up and make a play on fourth. Let's let's not get a safety now. We're on the two-yard line. Let's hand it off to the fullback. But you know, based on the situation, this offense did have to go for it. There you go, Rogers. Keep pushing. Get some breathing room. Picks up about three yards on that carry. Boy, this senior safety provides such solid run support. He stopped him in his tracks that time. In his tracks? We got three yards. We got three integral yards that we desperately needed. Just trying to get out from the end zone. Not only because we don't want a safety, but also because we need some just room period because our punter sucks balls. Oh, nobody, nobody could have stopped him. I am rather pissed off about that. If somebody would have stopped that guy, we would have had a big game. Push Hartman, push. To keep moving the ball. That time, they Should we go for a fake here? It would be so stupid to do. We'll let that clock run out a little bit. Not our best offensive drive, but we did run some time off the clock. Please kick it hard, Muhammad. Kick it more than 10 feet. I can't wait till next year when we have a new kicker. Why are you leaving LSU fans? Yeah, your team lost, but you might score a touchdown. They're in great field position. Excellent field position to start the drive. 331 left on the clock. Pass. He's looking for six. Oh, we almost got another pick. I think it's Brian Jean over there trying to get his hand on that dude. Balls. I do have no idea why they're running there. Just that must be desperation. I love it, though. I'll take it. Not just because I'm desperate. <laughs> what? That got really weird. They're like, Coach, we don't want to hear about your dating history. Looks to pass. He launches one for the end zone. No good. I'm not sure if they were thrown for the receiver or for the tiger there. It's fourth down and the if we can get this get back, we've won the game. We've probably won the game anyway. He 
Yeah, nice sack. Outstanding by Flab. You can do there. You gotta go for it and give yourselves a chance. You aren't gonna convert many fourth downs against this defense. That's you can see really Quinn is stuff. angry. They were number two in the nation, and they're about to First get shut six. out. On the 40 -yard line. Navy with a commanding lead. Just under three to go in regulation. Excellent open field tackle. That'll be a game of three yards. And the yeah, let's get back into our two down tight end set. We have just destroyed no them out of this set today. To run through. Navy in control. It might be a little Just tougher now because they're gonna know game. we're running. But that's all right. Come on, get that block! Get that block! <laughs> yeah, first down. Hartman had a huge day. I bet you he'll be player of the game again. He's been player of the game almost every year, every year, every game of the season. I'm a smart coach every year this season. What? We've got a first and ten. Navy up big. Less than two minutes in the fourth quarter. I am loving this game. I never thought... This is gonna was going to be the end result. Such a dominant win. I can't wait to see after this game, and I'll include it in this video to see if we get moved up to number one in the nation or not on the coaches poll. And I would think we'll be number one in the media poll because this is more than a little bit of a win. From the 46-yard line, second down. Navy Woo. up by a big margin, just over a minute in the fourth quarter. Uh, they still have timeouts, but obviously, I think they realize they can't get five scores to surmount the difference. Straight in the middle, and he meets the defense. And they pick up two yards. Good pressure from the defense. They brought the heat, and there wasn't much room for the running back to work with. Kind of shows how dominant we've been because this is one of the few times in the game where we actually are hearing the fans in the stands say something. We heard that at the beginning of the half and here at the end. We took them out of the game. The halfback with a carry. Go Hartman, go! Holy shit! That was a huge run. Again, we've seen this before, and the result is a big third down run. Absolutely outstanding. I love that. First and goal from the one, looking to punch this one in. We'll just run one more play. I don't want to be rude. Zone trip resulted in a touchdown. First play, though, we wouldn't be running this play. Touchdown! Suck it, LSU! How dare you try to challenge us? Just fell into place out there, and nothing was going to stop these guys from getting the ball into the end zone many, many times. If the coaches do not have us number one in the nation now, then you know it's a screw job. It's a conspiracy. We're going to stay undefeated. They might just kick it short to prevent a long return. Oh shit, I didn't mean to give him a free 40. Great job, Adams! <laughs> That's alright, we gotta run one more defensive play. And then it'll all be over. They'll go to work at the 40 yard line. We've got a first and 10. No, who, who committed the flag? Please don't be on us. <laughs> who did that? The game should be over, Jackson Flam. 
You're like, hey, I got one more chance to hurt the dude. No! record for sacks in a single season. This guy's beating the man across from him. Double teams, triple teams, chip locks. Like, the game is over. Don't give them a chance to score. Quinn drops back to pass. Oh, he's got And that is game. Finally played clean. Thank God there wasn't a pass interference. And this one comes to an end. Our final count in this game. Navy, 42. LSU, nothing. We are undefeated two-thirds of the way through the season. And we destroyed the number two na uh, ranked team of the nation. And here's today's Reese's Perfect Play of the Game. Brought to you by Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. The perfect combination of chocolate and peanut butter. Kirk, any final thoughts? Yeah, where in the world was the offense today? LSU was held scoreless for this entire game, and I don't think they expected that. They need to re-examine this offense and figure out how they can put some more points on the board. Uh, they helped thrown it to our guys a couple times. Quentin Daniels and I believe Dick Johnson both had interceptions returned for touchdowns and our defense was just great from the get-go for forcing a lot of three outs of the game, EA Sports will make a ten thousand dollar donation in his name to the school's general scholarship fund for Navy they continue their quest for a perfect season and for LSU a crushing loss and their shot at perfection ended today Thank you for attending thanks for joining us for another game of NCAA football 11 for Kirk Aaron and everyone here at EA Sports I'm Brad Nessler saying goodbye we'll see you next time we probably destroyed any chance LSU had now of making the championship, <laughs> which is a good feeling. So if we do make the BCS championship, we probably won't have to play them because we just took them out of the running for that. How about our defense, though? And even our offense on that two tight end formation, they just did a great job blocking. I need to remember that more two tight end uh, stuff. I didn't think our second tight end was that good at blocking, but we certainly came through today. Hell, our defense outscored them. Our defense scored 14 points. Uh, let's go look at the game stats a quick second before we look at the overall. And our offense played very clean, too. Look at that. Uh, Mr. America, 5 for 8. No touchdowns, but no picks. That's the big thing. And then Hartman, 167 yards. Had a huge rushing day. Hayden did a great job, you know, behind him. Rodgers is fullback. And then Ten Little Soul had some super clutch catches. And uh, Sheepy's had one, too. And then Allen, maybe we need to play him more. I believe he's our number two tight end, Allen. And he's a freshman. That's awesome. And then if we look at the defense, oh, the defense. I can't say enough about all of them. They were all great. Let's go see where we are in the standings. All right, we just beat the number two team in the nation. We didn't just beat them, we fucking dominated them. Let's see where we are in the top 20. What the? We're only number six? This is the coaches poll. Are you fucking kidding me? There are teams with losses ahead of us. Florida State and Oklahoma are ahead of us. Now, it's not like we haven't played good teams. We played Georgia, I think. I think we played Alabama, Notre Dame. We've played teams in the top 25. We've played teams in the top 10. And we only moved up to number six. Fuck you, coaches. And LSU only dropped down to number nine, which isn't so bad because we are a good team. I cannot believe that teams with losses are ranked ahead of us. I call bullshit. Where are we on the media poll? We're number two on the media poll. That at least makes sense. I could see an argument that maybe the Wolverines are ahead of us. I don't know what their schedule has been. But the coaches poll, these guys are drunk as fuck. Oh, that's the BCS rankings. I cannot believe the coaches have us as number six. I'm going to go punch some coaches in the gonads. I guess we're going to just have to keep proving we're number one. I know we're number one. Hopefully we stay number one. You know that. It'll be interesting if we play Michigan. It's too bad Ulysses S. Gill isn't on that team in reference to a different LP. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. Next time, we'll play game nine of the season and try and keep our undefeated run going as we're trying to make another run for the BCS championship. Take it easy.